Hey everybody, I'm Adrian Funk. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are doing another unboxing for a friend. And basically how these videos work is that I'm gonna be unboxing some CGC slabs uh, that belong to a friend of mine. He gets comic books slabbed all the time. Um, I do not. He wants to share his slabs with the comic book community, but he doesn't have a comic book channel. That's where I come in. Him and I have very different tastes in comic books, so it'll be very interesting to see what he gets and kind of what my reactions are to his. So it's kind of cool for me because I get to see different kinds of comics that I otherwise would not slab myself. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe. You'd really help support the channel. So the way this works is that I have three CGC slab boxes here. I do not know what is inside the box. I don't know how many books there are. I don't know who they were signed by. I don't know what the grades are. Um, the only things I will know are the convention that they were at and the facilitator that was being used. So otherwise, let's go ahead and open this up. First box is pretty light. I'm gonna guess there's only one slab in here uh, based on the weight. So again, this is a blind unboxing, which means I will not be looking at the books. Oh, I was wrong. There are two slabs in here. I can feel two slabs, so I was wrong. All right, first up, apologize for the glare. If you see any. This. this is The Boys, Dear Becky, number one by Dynamite Entertainment. This is a virgin cover by Carla Cohen. This is, uh, for those of you who watch The Boys, this is uh, Starlight, right? Is that right? Starlight? Not sure. Starlight, I think. Um, very cool. I've never seen this cover before. This is signed by Erin Moriarty, who is the actress who plays Starlight here. There's her signature. Nice and clear. I really like the placement of her signature and the color of the marker she used. Very easy to read. And yeah, this is a really cool, really cool virgin variant. Never seen it before. Oh, this is a Scorpion Comics exclusive. Uh, but yeah, very cool. Since this is a celebrity signature, I'm assuming this was expensive. A closer look at the cover. Very nice. Next up. Three, two, one. Oh, that's a cool Doom Patrol cover. Who's this signed by? Jovan Wade, the guy who plays Cyborg? I don't know any of the characters on Doom Patrol. This is a special edition of DC Patrol number 19. Kind of like the, uh, the vintage framing of this um, cover. The actor who plays Cyborg. I'm guessing this character? Since he's the only robot looking character here. Um, that's that's his signature right there. Kind of scribbly. I don't know what that weird thing is at the bottom. Like, well, what is that? I guess it's the cyborg guy, maybe? That's, that would be my guess. If, if that's true. Oh, I see. He, he wrote Cyborg Vic Stone. Got it. And okay, I got it. So he wrote Cyborg Vic Stone, and I think that is his real signature. Uh, Jovian Wade. So that's that's what that is. Whew. Um, that was hard. That was hard to figure out. I think I would have had him sign it here or up here, maybe. Um, I understand that he was trying to sign it next to his character, which makes total sense. But the fact that there is a very crazy leather jacket behind his signature and he signed in silver, so it's a little hard to read. The silver would have been best probably in a darker area, in the corners here, but um, otherwise still pretty sweet. All right, next up is, oh, this one's even lighter than the first one. Okay, definitely one slab, that, that's my guess here. Okay, so the facilitator was one-stop comic shop. Um, I used them before, very great service, great company. Um, they are the facilitators, which basically means um, Simpson, my friend, 
uh, sent a book to them and then they went to a convention or to a celebrity to get this book signed. That's my guess. Um, you would only ever send a book to a facilitator to get a signature that you are otherwise not able to get yourself. Well, oh, this one got dinged a little bit here. Scary. Here we go. That's right, one slab. You guys see this? All right, three, two, one. Oh, that's cool. This is the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 21. This is the Stan Lee Entertainment Box exclusive variant. Very cool. So instead of Zordon, you have Stan Lee's head. Here's a close up. There's a lot of signatures here. I'm very excited to see who has signed this. I'm guessing. The red here is Austin St. John, who played the Red Ranger. Let's see. Oh, there's even one up here. Is that... Let's see. So this was signed by Kimberly, Amy Jo Johnson, Zach by Walter Jones, Jason by Austin St. John, and Billy by David Yost. Wow, he had everybody. He has everyone except the Green Ranger and Trini, RIP, but uh, dang. This has almost everyone. Oh, except for uh, Zordon. Simpson, you gotta get on that. You need uh, Jason David Frank, the Green Ranger, and the guy who plays Zordon. Ha, huh. okay, so I was wrong. Um, this signature here is Zordon's signature. And the reason why I didn't realize that is because on the back of the, the label, I was reading only the front label, on the back label, it continues with who else has signed it, and it was signed by Zordon. David Fielding. So, um, yeah, he did get Zordon, so he really is only missing one signature, and that is Jason David Frank, the Green Ranger, um, who is, I think, currently doing a CGC signing. Very cool. Man, this, uh, this book, pretty pricey, pretty expensive, just saying. I might keep it. Last box, another light one. This one says it is also from One Stop Comic Shop. So I'm gonna assume that this was signed by a celebrity or a creator. Ah. I got a paper cut. That's what happens when you do a blind unboxing yourself. You're gonna cut yourself. Hopefully I don't bleed all over these slabs. Here we go, last one. Three, two, one. This is the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers 26. The Red Ranger variant. Very cool. Very expensive. Don't know why. Very nice. This is a uh, Carlos Villa cover. He actually did one of uh, all the other Rangers, so it's, you know, basically the original one and then all the other variations of that Ranger throughout the series, signed by the original American Red Ranger, Austin St. John, right on the crotch, baby. Thigh to thigh. If I could have this signed, I would probably have it up top in black, or in red, actually. Dark red up at the top would have been my preference, but, um, Right here is good too. It's it's good. And it's in silver, so you can read it. Very nice. I mean, it makes sense you would sign it here because it's by the original Red Ranger, so I get it. But yeah, very cool. You can kind of see all the other iterations of the, the Red Ranger here. Very cool, all of the art style. I would, yeah, and it's 9.8. The 9.8, very nice. I would, I would totally, uh, totally jack this book for my own collection. Very nice. And that is it, just a short little unboxing video. Again, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe. For more comic book content, you can visit Instagram and Twitter under Asian Funk Comics. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.